From the Lloyd Noble Center in Norman, the Big 12 Championship is on the line. Sooner Basketball is presented by OU Health on Sooner Vision from ESPN+. Plus. The two teams who shared the Big 12 regular season title a season ago are going to determine who wins it again. Senior night at the Lloyd Noble Center as the 20th-ranked Oklahoma Sooners host the third-ranked Texas Longhorns in the final Big 12 regular season home game. Lace them up. Let's get ready to run. Every Kim Hobbs in there to toss it up. Madison Booker and the Longhorns will go to work first. Moving about in that starting lineup, Amina Muhammad has started from time to time, but Shea Holly is averaging 37 minutes per game since the injury to Rory Harmon. And Shaley Gonzalez, she is sixth nationally. Oklahoma pushing early here in transition. Van lines another up, and this one is good. 3-2 Sooners. Sooners had a nine-game winning streak. They've won 11 of their last 12 with only a loss at West Virginia. And they go over the top again to Taylor Jones. Keys tried to feed that to Culleton. And Booker takes it away for the Longhorns. Long hit ahead. Gonzalez is open, and it's in. Try to lob it up backside for Deanna Gaston, who didn't play in the first meeting. And Gonzalez sticks a three. Now one of nine from three-point range. Booker is a one-player fast break when she rebounds it. Jones couldn't finish, and Moore does. Taylor Jones found herself on a mismatch. Raina Scott and Kirsten Johnson just forgot to put a body on Aaliyah Moore. You can't do that against Moore. She's incredible on the boards. On such a stacked team. At about four seconds difference between the shot clock and the game clock. More blocked by Kirsten Johnson. Vic Schaefer said that they've been much more intentional on the defensive end, and that's definitely what we see tonight. Back cut Williams. Berholz led her with a beautiful pass. Getting in rhythm, getting that jump shot. She rarely misses. Keys wide open, and that rims in. Oklahoma much needed that. They are two for ten from three-point range. Oklahoma getting lots of back cuts. Verhulst and Oklahoma has made back-to-back -back threes now. And Jones has to go to the bench. Gaston back in with just one foul. Culleton posts up and scores. Gaston kind of slipped. And deep this Longhorn team is. Keys gets run off the three-point line. Gaston blocked that one. It went off of Keys out of bounds. Booker, foul line jumper, cash. Again, on that side of the court, but it's so difficult when they are just pounding it down the midline. Back cut, Kennedy Tucker scores. Good pass, too, by Peyton Verholst. Culleton in that mid post. And Verholst fires and hits again. She's got a dozen now. Here's Oklahoma ball movement. Coach Bronchick emphasizes ball movement. Peyton Verholst not even looking at the basket. It's been a big part of Oklahoma's improvement. Tot open. And that's down. Oklahoma on the run. 7-0 Oklahoma run in progress. Texas once led by 15. Open three keys. And that's good. Berholst got a decent look and hit it. We've got a one-point game. <laughs> wow. Yeah, Beatrice Cole did a nice job on that screen to open up Peyton Berholst. Williams forces her way to the window and in. We see Williams here, a high post, taking Taylor Jones to the block. Good defense by Taylor Jones. And Oklahoma has been so good at not turning the ball over. That's been their difference. Turned it over about 20 times a game in non-conference play, only 13. Of her players, they went through a slump in December, but have really come out through conference and put the pressure on their opponent. Lexi Keys driving hard to the basket. Whips it into Kirsten Johnson, and she converts it. At the court, here's Nevaeh Tott off this screen. Madison Booker going under, but a rare missed block out there by the Sooners. And Leah Moore makes them pay. But here comes Oklahoma on the other end. Skylar Van with a pass to Aubrey Jones. 4-3, Aubrey Jones nails it. And here's Aubrey Jones with the three. Feels like she's not so much 
feeling her performance is based on shooting. Kirsten Johnson escapes and scores. And here's an Oklahoma run. Getting it done on both ends of the court. Nevaeh Tott with a nice pass ahead to Kirsten Johnson, again beating everyone. Deep post position, and Gaston scores. Well done by the Sooners on that possession. Bam, a little ball fake. Verhulst lines one up. That one's good. Hasn't played a lot, in fact, since January 27th against Cincinnati. Lexi Keys open and hitting. Here in the fourth, Whitney. Yeah, here's Sahara Williams on the baseline with the extra pass from Tot. Verhulst down the seam, and the follow by Williams lands in a one-point game. And then you have Sahara Williams trailing the play. We've got a great one in Norman. Sahara Williams trying to work free, but can't. The steal. Booker leads the pack to the window and in. Texas back up three. Remember Peyton Verholst on the bench with four fouls right now for Oklahoma. Van has four and scores anyway. Keys, corner three, home. And Oklahoma has its first lead since it was 3-2. You see Beatrice Culleton's sneaky screen on Madison Booker. Gonzalez, veteran. She's been through the battles, and she missed that one. Back up and in is Jones and a foul. And Taylor Jones doing a nice job on this rebound. Able to get the putback. One minute left. Sahara Williams blocked. Verhulst back up. No. And out of bounds, it stays here. Williams slipped through her hands, and then she slipped. Jones picks it up. And if that's a foul on Verholst, it's five. What do we have? Texas ball, and a foul on Peyton Verholst. She has fouled out. In the van, underneath, no. Rebound, keys for three, good! Wow, Lexi Keys. Ice cold. Skyler Van, no, rebound after rebound. Oklahoma just won't quit. The Skylar Van here just battling down low. It just pops out to Lexi Keys. Oklahoma bench going crazy. Wow, Taylor Jones had position there. Four point five to play, a Big 12 title, perhaps for the taking. Booker stripped. And Oklahoma has won the Big 12 championship. Wow. In historic fashion. You can feel the excitement in this gym right now, these fans. The 14th time that Oklahoma has come back from double digits in three seasons under Jenny Baranchek.